The reason I'm choosing this ship is because, in my opinion, it's one of the best ships in the game. It starts off with the weapons. If I, if I get hacking, I can basically kill the boss with this. Accept every surrender, and when they try to run, only shoot engines. You also need to bribe everyone who asks for it. So I have to pay tolls, is what you're saying? Bribe everyone who asks for it. Who asked for bribes? Are you talking about tolls? Is that what you mean? Okay, so I have to take tolls. I have to take bribes. Rock A. I'm not doing this on Rock A. All right, so I have to accept every surrender. <laughs> All right. The adjudicator. The diplomatic mission to Alderaan. What was the ship? What was the ship that Princess Leia in Episode 4 was, was, uh, was on? That they're a diplomatic mission to Alderaan. Does anybody know that ship? Here's some Star Wars trivia. What's the name of the ship? That Darth Vader boards Leia on. The Envoy? Taunty 4? Is that what it's called? The Taunty... Wow, that's... That's some good Star Wars trivia right, th right there. The name of that ship was the wrong ship. <laughs> wow, you guys know this. You guys are awesome. I better... I need to have you guys on my team when I do Star Wars trivia. We'll try this on normal... Let's try normal difficulty first, and then we'll swap to easy if uh, we can't do it on normal. Got to take a break from as intended. All right, the Ton T4. Piloted by, no, uh, engines by Leia Organa Solo. Well, she's not solo yet. Leia Organa. There we go. We go with this full Star Wars meme here. Piloted by... C three C three P O Is the O a zero or a oh oh I don't actually know. I, I'll do a number. And then we gotta have Mr uh C three PO and um R two D two. R two D two. There we go. Obi Ran Kenobi. Yes, we're gonna find Obi Ran Kenobi and Luke Skywalker. Sometime on this run. <laughs> this is this is the this is the diplomatic mission to Alderaan, guys. If you get borders, be careful with Darth Vader, that's right. Your boy Antilles next crew you get. <laughs> Alrighty. We are basically recreating Star Wars episode four right here. I can't kill him. What what do I do about auto scouts? I gotta remember. Okay, we're a diplomatic mission to Alderaan. Are we allowed to kill auto scouts? What? What are? What are? I, you guys have to remind me. I know it's a peaceful thing. I have to jump away every run. Okay, no pork and sound. Me attacks first thing he sees. I almost did. I didn't, but I almost did. Okay. Auto scouts are loss of life. You vote kill the drone? Okay. Only drones are allowed to kill. I'm 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 killing drones. Otherwise this challenge too dumb. They aren't alive. Okay. So we have to take uh we, I mean I have to pay tolls and stuff, but drones I'm allowed to kill. Yeah, I do I wanna definitely upgrade engines. That's good with Zoltan Shield anyway. Okay, a fire beam for a peaceful Alderaan mission. <laughs> uh, okay. All right, all right. Uh, well, he's asking for stuff, so here you go. Have some fuel. Hey, reactor upgrade. Nice. Thank you. Do 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 do. No killing. Drones are not life. Okay, cool. Ships that only have humans on them don't count as a life either. <laughs> All right, so far I've only fought drones. This is a great start to this challenge. This is the first challenge of the day. No, we did a. I got wrecked on a couple attempts of Lanius runs. Although I got the win the second time. Fire equals no kill. <laughs> I'm just burning my enemies alive. What are you talking about? I'm not killing anybody. Fire beam, peace run, pacify with fire. 
Wow, I just got double rewards there. That's amazing. Okay. Um, get piloting, and then we work towards more engines here. Engines for running away. You must always help civilians, dumb humans included. Okay. This ain't peaceful. You're liberating them. Well, they're auto scouts. That's just drones. We're making sure the drones don't report our position to Darth Vader. It's really all it is. Okay. Feels like the naive captain challenge. It is pretty similar, yeah. Hope I can't use weapons here, so we'll just do this. Hope I get some doges. Well, zero dodges so far. Hey, there's one. Hey, okay, there's some dodges. Let me let me leave. I don't want to be here anymore. Am I allowed to bomb them to disable them? Am I allowed to do that? As long as I'm not killing them, right? I feel like I can do things like take out their missiles. As long as I don't kill them. Okay. Cool. There we go. So I should have done that earlier, but... Wow. Wow. He just got a double shot there. Oh my god. I hate this game. This game's stupid. Oh, lovely. He's got a double shot there, too. Okay, we dodged that one, though. Can I, can I get the hell out of here, please? Thank you. Um, wow, this sector, though. Holy crap. One, two, three would be a... Not a dive. Four, five, six. Seven, eight. Okay. Red, I am the Senate. <laughs> so, okay. A conspicuous pirate-marked ship. I guess I hail the ship, right? <laughs> Hi. Hey, guys. What's up? We have an extensive stock. Come aboard and see our wares. Okay. That sounds like a great deal. What do you have aboard? A human exquisite, an exquisite suit meets you on board. Welcome to my ship. We specialize in drones of all kind. Oh, man. I would love to buy some drone parts. Sadly, I don't have any money. You shouldn't waste a cat people's time, Captain. Well, my ship's on fire. My ship's uh, completely on fire. So... Uh, okay, I think I might be dead here. Honestly. Um, I, I, I won't be able to put out this fire in time. So, cool. I move for voter no confidence in Chancellor Rand Lorem. <laughs> All right, we got the laser offline, but I have no engines, so I currently can't leave until we vent this. All right, we're gonna disable this guy while we try to eventually. Uh, I actually have no. Okay. Uh. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, I can't fix that till I fix my O2. Alright. Now you're not doing anything in here, so I guess you'll help here. Man, Pacifist run apparently is uh, kind of rough on your ship. Vent the fire. Yeah, and venting the fire means I now have no O2, so I did it. But... Not exactly, you know, leaving us in great shape here. Okay, all right. Well, let's see if uh, we can live. Look at all those breaches. The droid's about to suffocate. I know, a little, little awkward there. Do, 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 do. Hey, my Lido's breaching him, though. Do, 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 do. All right, all right. I think we're fine. You know, this is fine. You know, this is a normal interaction with guys. Hey, they offered me. 
They offered me a deal. I have to take it. <laughs> I'm I am a very peaceful person, so I I would love to accept your cargo. Oh, you know what? I'll deliver that for you. I'll hand deliver that cargo to wherever it needs to go. So I guess technically for this challenge, what I could do as I could do with damage with my halberd beam trying to make them surrender. Am I am I allowed to do that or is that not in the spirit of the challenge? I'm a little unsure if that's in the spirit of the challenge to halberd beam them in hopes that they surrender and give me stuff. Uh, I'm just I'm not sure if that's if that's in the spirit of what we're going for here. Doesn't sound very peaceful. Yeah, it doesn't. <laughs> Quote, I am a very peaceful person by Emperor Ran. That's right. Aggressive negotiation. Yes, I think so. We need the challenge to work still. All right. If nothing else, I'm going to try to just, as long as I count the damage. If I do stuff like this. Where I'm just trying to disable their ship. That's peaceful. I'm just peacefully trying to disable their ship. There. See? Just a peaceful disabling of their ship. It's peaceful from a certain point of view. <laughs> I'm setting him on fire. It's peaceful from a certain point of view. All right. You giving up? See? I'm just peacefully asking for them to give me their stuff. A certain point of view. <laughs> it's working. It's <laughs> actually a pretty effective negotiation tactic. It's called aggressive negotiation, guys. It's just it's just aggressive negotiation. I don't know why people say I'm a tyrant. Peaceful. I'm totally not hitting their life support. That's right. Accept their bribe. See? I'm peacefully accepting all these bribes. Um... I don't know how I'm going to upgrade my ship to kill the end boss doing this. Do I go for shields? Do I just keep getting engines? Uh, the negotiations were short. <laughs> but effective. You can't hear their screams in the void of space. It's very peaceful. It's right. Uh, is this... Okay, nego negotiation giving, giving person a slave... Is this considered... I will make it legal. I, I don't know if this is a deal I have to take. No? Okay. Giving them a slave. Okay, we run away. Okay. Well, run while simultaneously killing, uh, doing damage. I mean, disabling them. We take a slave from them. <laughs> that's, that's aggressive negotiations right there. We'll make it legal. Well, that's an NG repairing for sure. I'm just going to just a little bit hit this other room. Just a little bit of damage. I can run. I'm going to see if this missile is going to hit me first. See how well my ne aggressive negotiation works. It works great. Okay. All right, so I think we accept the slave and then we free him. Is that what we do? You need to free purchase every slave you see. Oh. So am I freeing him by taking him? One, two, three, four. Free him into the airlock? Call him Antilles. Um, I kind of want to call him Luke Skywalker and... Have him be my pilot. <laughs> what are the rules of this run? It's like a diplomatic mission that we're making up rules to, basically. You know what? Obi-Wan Kenobi or Luke Skywalker? Who is he? Luke Skywalker, the pilot's good. Let's go for it. Luke Skywalker. Aren't you a little short for Stormtrooper? Huh? Oh, the uniform. Should be Han Solo, Luke, Luke, best pilot in the galaxy. <laughs> Go 
Can I do anything at this store? Uh, no. Uh, I can sell my fire beam. And maybe get something? Can I get anything? Reconstruct teleport, pre-igniter, backup battery. The goal is no kill. Yeah, we're basically not killing anybody. We can kill auto scouts, but we're not killing anybody. We're basically trying to get them to surrender is what our, our uh, goals have been so far. Use the RNG, Luke. No sensors run. Use the force only. <laughs> so I need a slug to, to mind control with. Okay. I wish I could get mind control. Uh, I guess I get nothing here. Maybe I get shields. Yeah, surrender or escape. Because we, uh, we are a diplomatic mission to Alderaan. We are a peaceful envoy. Aid the ship because we are helpful. We are, we are, saving, we are saving these people from pirates right here. I am altering the deal. Your Jedi mind tricks won't work on me. Also strong with this one. Okay. Retreat in our moment of triumph? I think you overestimate their chances. <laughs> so, gonna quote all of the Star Wars movies, all of them. Okay. Why aren't you, uh, why aren't you offering me a surrender, sir? Huh? Huh? All right, one more time. If he doesn't surrender, we leave. These aren't the droids or slaves you are looking for. That's right. All right, he's not giving up. All right. We'll leave them to their fate, I guess. I guess that's what we're doing. We leave them to their fate. We shall respond. Look at this cargo of drone parts. You know what? We are a peaceful diplomatic mission to Alderaan. It's on our way. We'll do it. When you go peaceful games like you and you get three dodges and chain with 25% chance. If you aren't dodging enough, try spinning. That's a cool trick. <laughs> Explore the asteroid field. Sure. Uh oh. Um, if I take out his shields, I might kill this guy. So we'll just try to get his weapons down and run. Do or do not, there is no try. That is correct. I really hope I get the eye on offline. Perfect. Any plans on how to deal with the flagship? We're allowed to kill the flagship. That's the only ship we're allowed to kill. Damn it. Actually, we can do this. We can be immune to the ion. That's what we do. Think smarter, not harder, boys. Uh, I don't think he's gonna give up, so we're gonna leave. NG control. We need NGs to give us lots of good deals. I mean, the asteroids killed them, not you. No, <laughs> no. No, we're not gonna we're not gonna go down that road. Not yet anyway. We can kill auto scouts, yes. We did we did say auto scouts are allowed. Okay, and this guy's gonna offer us a bad deal, so we're gonna be the gullible people who take the bad deal, I think. You're supposed to deliver drone parts to a station here. Took you long enough. We have practically no use for these now. I refuse to pay full price. That's that's understandable. We we really failed on our in our in our in our delivery, so we will take the paltry payment. All right, I accept that. I will accept your rebuke. All right, let's get second shield. So, actually, our plans for the flagship are to get hacking. Hacking and halberd beam and hope that's enough to kill the boss with whatever defenses we end up with. Get hacking, and that's our build, basically, is our plan. This won't kill him. Will you offer us a deal? No deal. Uh, uh, one more swipe that, like that, might kill him. So, nope, it'll only be four damage. So this will not kill him. We can do this one more time. Find your lack of faith disturbing. All I want to, for you to do is uh, give us a deal. Oh, wow! He decided to board us. Okay. Uh, that is not the deal I was looking for. Okay. Well, let's vent him. Am I allowed to vent <laughs> a boarding mantids? I, it's Darth Vader. <laughs> Get away from me, Darth Vader. Run away. We fought Darth Vader. 
We did fight it. Um, NG Research Station. Oh my god, do we board it to try to save people? I guess we do. You can only vent boarding humans. <laughs> You're built for the flagship to believe in the force and shoot his exhaust. That's that's what I'm built for. I think we could lose crew here, but I guess we do this. Okay. The station reactor's overloading. They're running out of time. Save the NG. Save the drone. Save yourselves. Save the NG. Oh no, we lost Leia Organa. She was... Leia Organa Solo has been lost to the Empire. She has been taken aboard the Death Star. We will have to avenge her. She was captured. <laughs> uh, all right. All right. Poor Leia was captured. She sacrificed her lives to bring us this information. Many Leia Organa... Organas died to bring us this information. I have very low on fuel, by the way. Hey, free stuff, though. Cremity can be Jar Jar Binks, the guy that nobody wanted on the ship. <laughs> All right, sure, sure. <laughs> All right, Binks. You better pull your weight around here. No, he'll kill everyone. Doth Jar Jar. She was obviously part of the Rebel Alliance. Need to be taken away. <laughs> Two, three, four, five, six. Well, I need to buy fuel. I need to get hacking. I just don't have enough scrap because for some reason we're not getting that much scrap. Whoops. There we go. No hacking. Okay. Gotta buy all the fuel. Not quite sure how we're gonna win this run. Jar Jar Binks is actually a Sith Lord. Uh, specialty. Yeah, sure. I'm. I love deals. Um, I. I'm gonna decline that. That's not a bribe. That's me paying for a service. That's a terrible deal. I may be gullible. Two, three, four, five. But I'm not that gullible. We're fighting against the rebels? Oh, yeah. Oh, God. I'm so confused about my life right now. Jar Jar is an NG. That's impossible. That would mean he is competent. <laughs> but not fighting. So that's actually kind of fitting. He's an incompetent fighter. I mean, you guys see what he did against the dro drone army, right? If Jar Jar is incompetent, that can only mean he's a human. Okay. Forty scrap for pilot is terrible. Bad. Yeah, it only saved you what one uh, ten scrap. I mean, for a deal, it does save you some, but I don't want to spend my scrap on piloting when I am just running away from everything. Well, maybe it would have been worth it. One, two, three. Now I got four jumps here. I really need free stuff from Engies right now. Jar Jar Binks would break systems instead of repairing them. <laughs> All right. Yay, a guy I can kill. I mean, this is a peaceful mission to Alderaan. Even though you've stolen our princess, we're tr trying to hack into you and get information on where she is kept so I can save her. Is level 3 piloting ever worth it? Uh, it's usually one of the last things I get. There might be a blue option or two for it, but it's usually not worth it. We actually want to fight auto scouts, I guess, to get scrap. All right, there we go. We got a little scrap. That's no moon. It's a fully operational battle station. Okay, free fuel. Cool. Armed and operational battle station. Yay! All right. <laughs> Yay for Jar Jar Binks. Jar Jar Binks just got us that blue option. He may be incompetent, but he knows how to talk to people. Um, small rebel ship seems to have been refitted for transport rather than combat. Does not want to engage us. We avoid. I think we, as a peaceful envoy, we avoid the ship. We wouldn't try to 
demand the surrender of their goods. So we avoid the ship. Diplomatic mission to Alderaan. All right. Um, Mantis Homeworlds. Uh, I think we go Rebel and hope for some more auto scouts, <laughs> I guess. And upgrade my Lido, maybe. If I could find hacking, it would be really good for us. As of right now, I can't do anything to two shield ships unless they have no... Um, no value point in their shields. Okay, that's a pulsar. Okay. Surrender the cargo equals demand the return of the princess. <laughs> I feel like we're just justifying murder here now. Thank you for the follow. Menorongas, thank you so much for follow. Appreciate it. Welcome to the stream, my friend. Damn. He timed his missile perfectly. Hey, but we dodged it. Okay. Oh, and I can get shield, uh, by doing that, too. Okay. Crap. Ah, oh, crap. I was too late. Help us, Jabber Jar Banks. You're great at putting out fires, right? All right, we got to leave the Pulsar. Name suggestion, Wicket. W. Warwick. Okay. Well, I get the reference, but, uh... Wicket was, there was a, uh, what was it, Battle for Endor? What was that, what was that extra, that other Star Wars movie? I think it was Battle for Endor. I loved watching that as a kid. I think it was Battle for Endor. It had, uh, it had the guy, oh, uh, what's his name? Diabetes. It had that guy in the movie. Had diabetes guy in the movie. Uh, the Christmas special? No, not the Christmas special. I think it was actually called The Battle for Endor, and it was it was a movie that was about the Ewoks. Oh, what is what is the diabetes guy? What's his name? Kind of terrible that that's what he's known for. But he was actually in The Battle for Endor. I'm pretty sure. You like Christmas special the most. <laughs> okay. Oh god, I can't remember that guy's name. Nobody in chat's telling me. Um what do I do here? Um, I mean, I guess we run. I guess we do this, do as much damage, and then run here. Actually, I do this. This won't kill him, right? Even at the max damage would be 10. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. That wouldn't kill him. So we're, we're just trying to disable him. Diabetes guy could be the worst hint ever to figure out somebody. Yeah, yeah the guy... He was, he was in all those commercials about diabetes. <laughs> diabetes. Hey, it's like a meme. It's a freaking meme. Surely, surely. <laughs> the worst clue ever. It's a freaking meme. Or maybe it was a family guy thing. Diabetes. Just, just Google diabetes guy, and I bet you it brings that up who it is. I bet you, like, five pennies. It'll bring up exactly who it is. It's the guy, it's a older guy with a mustache. I mean, he was in Battle for Endor. I mean, you know movies, Shogi. If you can't get it from Battle for Endor. Old fat guy who said diabetes. That's right. Yes. <laughs> that guy. Wilford Brimley. That's right. That's right. That's exactly who it is. Shogi, other people knew who it was. You didn't know it. You are a failure. Shogi is a failure at movie trivia. Everybody shame Shogi for not knowing uh, Wilford Brimley. I think is that right? Yeah, I think that's right. 
Let me, you know what? I gotta check this just to make sense, just to make sure. Let me see. Wilford Brimley. Yep. <laughs> it's this guy. It's this guy right here. Diabetes. Shogi should have known. He was in Battle for Endor. You know what? I'm going to actually, real quick, uh, IMDB. I, I hope I'm allowed to show IMDB on stream. I feel like I could. Battle for Endor. Ewoks. The Battle for Endor. Wilford Brimley. Warwick Davis. Right there. Right there. Diabetes guy in Ewoks. The Battle for Endor. If you guys don't know this movie, there's another uh, Star Wars movie for you. 5.5 stars out of 10, by the way. <laughs> you toss out diabetes guy like I know who that is. It doesn't count. I still stand undefeated. Totally counts. Shogi. Shame. Shame. I knew a movie thing that Shogi did not know. IMD also owned by Amazon. Hey, then we're fine. Uh, pirate. Are we allowed to attack pirates? Um... To try to get him to, we're trying to get this pirate to surrender. And if he doesn't surrender, we leave. It's your favorite, second favorite ship? What's up, Zach Dog? Well, we're doing this as a peaceful diplomatic mission to Alderaan. So, this is better than The Last Jedi? 100% agree. 100% agree. Hundred percent better than Last Jedi. Okay, you haven't surrendered yet. Two, four, six. Okay. Uh, do three more damage. See if he'll surrender. Nah, he's just trying to run. All right, all right. I'll let you go this time, pirate. And by let you go, I mean I'll run away first, hopefully. Who's attacking? It's a pirate. There's a pirate. I was trying to see if he would surrender his pirate ways, but he refused. Yes, we're trying to convert the pirate via damage to their weapons. <laughs> this is a forward scout of the rebel fleet, so... I'm trying to keep him from running to get Princess Leia away from us. He doesn't have value points, so we can maybe... 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Alright, this won't kill him. But hopefully it'll keep him from running. And maybe get him to surrender. No surrender. Okay. Well, it delays him. You can't run from me. Not if I'm running from you. <laughs> Hashtag I run faster. Okay. Who can run away faster? Actually, it'd probably help if I put my engines up higher. Fine, take this rand. What's the name of Gold Leader? If you don't know, your forever Star Wars banished from the realm. Gold Leader. Hmm. Porkins was red. Red Leader, right? Yeah, I'm, I'm definitely not going to be able to think of that. Ships can still surrender even after they try to run, I think. Not sure if pirates in particular do this. Hey, we got a free repair. Okay. Okay. There's hacking, and I have exactly enough for hacking, but then I can't buy fuel. Uh, you know what? The swarm missile would be better than the Lido. We have to get hacking, though. We just, we have to get that. I think I sell Lido and get fuel. No, I can't kill. God, I wish I could use the swarm missile. Is that considered aggressive negotiation? No, it's being planned to use against the final boss. Gold leader. I can't think of it, Shogi. I don't know. Man, if only we had more scrap from running away from all these fights. John Vander, a.k.a. Gold leader. I'm back on top, baby. <laughs> okay. Um... Well, I guess if we're going to use hacking for a nego aggressive negotiation, we just get rid of our missile. So I need fuel right now. I also need level 2 hacking, I think. So... 
I'm gonna hold off on getting anything else. I don't know how we're gonna have, get enough scrap to be able to kill the boss, honestly. You tried to whisper to Rand to cheat? Uh, <laughs> no one ever cared about Vander, and you know it. <laughs> oh, man, stop trying to run away. Okay. Well, at least we got our hacking to... to use our halberd beam here. Way more people care about Diabetes Guy than John Dutch, a.k.a. Vander, whatever his name is, that nobody's ever actually heard of. Damn, okay. Well, missile being online is okay. One missile, okay, not terrible. Rand speaks the truth. See, Master Magus agrees. Totally, totally paid him a bunch of cookies for him to say that a second ago, though. Pie leader standing by. <laughs> Rand 5 standing by. Please don't hit my weapons. I have a value point at least. Okay. Oh, that's a double fire. Okay. All right. Killed our auto scout, friend. Do, 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 do. Hides cookies. What cookies? Nobody gave me any cookies. These are, um, biscuits. They're just biscuits, right? <laughs> Pie Boy just gave him <laughs> cookies. <laughs> uh. All right, there's a store. I really need level two hacking, though. How many jumps do I have? I have six. What could I get from the store? Long range scanners. Would I even want to get those right now? That would be seven jumps. I think we just go one, two, three. These are not the cookies you're looking for. Next run, be the Empire and crush the Rebellion. <laughs> uh, did I use a drone part here? Nah, we just want to run quickly. Quickly, run away, run away. I could hack his weapons. It's a little late, though. He's got that thing. I guess I could just do this to get rid of it and hack his weapons if I want to. By the way, for anybody who's a fan of PoE, I watched some videos for the Path of Exile League. I'm actually pretty excited about it because it's actually Tower Defense League. Oh, don't hack. Okay, O2, that's fine. Tower Defense and Path of Exile. Looks ridiculous and amazing. I'm actually very excited because I love Tower Defense games. All right. All right, I probably just need to get level two hacking here for the three shield ships we'll most likely be running into. Oh, man. Second halberd beam would be amazing. Can't afford it. Okay, so let's go ahead and do this. One repair, two fuel. All righty. Well, we're going to sector four with this peaceful run. <laughs> All right, prepare to die. Um, will you surrender if I don't prepare to die? If I'm not prepared to die, how will you respond? I'll do... I'll do six damage to him. You want surrender yet? Okay, how about if I do that one more time? Get double glade beams and become the Death Star. We will crush this rebellion with the swift stroke, huh? <sighs> Everybody's running away. This is the day of everybody want running away from Rand. Wanting away from Wand. Stop wanting away from Wand. I want to fight you. Do, 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 do. Take one more shot, even though I don't think he's going to... Yeah, he's not going to run. I had to kill that border. That was in self-defense, guys. Darth Vader's not allowed on our ship. Sure, I can sell missiles. One of the few ways I can actually get scrap, I think. 
Okay, so I kind of need power right now. You just killed that man! <laughs> He's only human. I mean... He was... He was attacking us with his space laser, and I had to defend myself. I tried Stealth A and Zoltan A runs with zero ships killed recently on hard. Feels like you need to get all NG sectors with no fights. Yeah, there's no way. Retreat, retreat. Now, this is normal difficulty, and I'm thinking of trying it on easy if I really want to try to complete it. Hey, but there's a second NG sector, though. <laughs> Pybo pushes body out of the airlock. What human? I, I don't see any dead bodies. There's no dead bodies here. Uh, I need power. Spend some scrap on power, I guess. Let's alter this challenge. You can kill as long as you don't have your jump charged. I am altering the deal. Uh, I'm helping pirates by carefully cutting them out. Now, you go and be good pirates and stop your pirating ways. He was a noble hero trying to save the galaxy from Darth Jar Jar. <laughs> Should be diplomatic like the Spanish Empire was diplomatic. Okay. I can't, I can't offer Mantis in exchange for bounties, I don't think. This is a fugitive. He's just running from the Empire. We must, we must help him. It was a tarp. Frickin' Mantis, I knew it. I knew I couldn't trust these Mantids. Alright, fire beam. Wow. There's some, uh, there's some diplomatic weaponry right there. Does fire beam get through shields? I'm not actually sure. I will purposely not beam the mantid. That's pretty good doges. Just kidnap the emperor and demand a room full of gold. <laughs> a room full of gold, you say? <laughs> Is, do they have roomfuls of gold in Star Wars? All right, are you gonna are you gonna surrender? I can only hit two rooms here, or else I kill them. Okay, no surrender. All right, you stop. You know, misleading people about wanting to run away from people and stuff. Tell the Spanish Spanish topple to Inca, so it should work here. Okay. That was uh, skill avoiding three anti hack shots. Well, I only avoided two, and then it, the third one didn't have time, so. Oh, a distress call. We must help them. All right. Sadly, we couldn't save them. Free stuff. <laughs> All right, well, we have to go to the store and, like, repair and get fuel. <laughs> Every store, we just get repair and fuels. Um, refugee ship. What's happening, refugees? A really good deal. I kind of need my drone parts, but that's a really good deal, so I'm going to take it. Demand a scantily clad slave empress. I like the way you think, Arnaspa. I like the way you think. All right. Drone control, cloaking, mind control. I'd like to get mind control. I don't know if I can afford to get mind control, though. We need the cantina music for the run. I won't link because potential copyright. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I wouldn't be able to upload us on YouTube if we did that, sadly. With how much I've said Star Wars, I wonder if I'll get, you know, banned by Disney. Since they own Star Wars World. Um, how, how do I think I could actually win this run? Is there any possible way? What would I get? I would need a free weapon... I would need to get cloaking, I feel like. There's just no way. Your impressions of the Star Wars quotes are too good. They'll claim that too. <laughs> I guess I just repair. I probably should have got mind control to use the force to control people's minds. Probably what I should have done. Mickey Mouse is a Sith Lord. Sounds legit. Well, we're getting free stuff. Uh, hopefully this store will have mind control. Hey. Okay. So this is one where they will surrender. Six. One, two, three, four, five, six. They'll surrender and then give me quests. This is actually a quest we can do. 
kill them, kill, uh, pay you, we'll kill you as long as you don't pay them all. Pay you with hell so long as you don't kill them all. Yes. Yes. We could do this, guys. We could do it. Ah, uh, lovely, peaceful NG quests. Ooh, the double doge. The dumble doge. Can I hit five rooms in any way here? Not quite. Okay. We're terrible. We're not cut out for this. Let them live. Let them live. Thanks for the chain ion, bros. Thanks for the chain ion. Okay. We'll be able to sell that at the store. Nice. You need to kill the ship in the final beacon, if I recall. That's true. That is true. Hmm. Is it worth doing the quest then? Because you they tell you where the actual ship is. What is the quest, though? The quest is like... Finding some rebel... Under, this is like to unlock the stealth ship. I'm trying to think if it would make sense for us to kill this one ship. Could we, could we alter the deal to allow me to kill this one ship because it's an NG Homeworlds quest? Could we do that? I am altering the deal. Um, I mean, it's three quests, and I'm only killing one of those three quests. One, two, three, four, five. I'll give myself the option for it. Why wouldn't you just accept their surrender as part of the quest? I did just accept their surrender. Um, but we're talking about this quest right here. They're all trying to run away. You get information about where the actual ship is that you're supposed to chase. And then the final one, you have to actually kill the ship. I don't think the final ship allows you to surrender or allows a surrender or anything like that. So, Demand information on stolen technology. Too bad you followed the wrong ship. Let us go. All right, I'll let you go. You, you drive a hard bargain. <laughs> he was about to send a boarding drone on me, actually. Yeah, the final ship of this quest is actually one you have to fight. Alright, well, we can sell this chain ion. Uh, for mind control, okay. Or defense drone. I think it just makes sense that our Luke Skywalker pilot can mind control his enemies. So we're going to do that. We really need power. Shame we never said rebels were fair game. Yeah. Okay. Okay. All right. So we got to get our information out of these guys. I have four drone parts, by the way. Oh, and I can't even see in their ship. I guess we can mind control this guy. Do, do. Demand information on stolen technology. All right. I don't know what they were carrying. I'll transmit coordinates. Just let us go. All right. All right. We'll let you go. We're supposed to be the rebels. We're fighting our own forces here. <laughs> Buy six fuel for 12 scrap. One of the better deals we'll get, I guess. Rebel stronghold. <laughs> Can I kill the under construction flagship? Because we said the only ship we're allowed to kill is the flagship. Does the under construction flagship... That would be like killing... The under construction... Uh, Death Star, right? Yeah, so this would be basically... Episode 6. Okay, alright, cool. <laughs> nice. Glad you guys are on board. It's a way to get some scrap here. It's the second Death Star that you just fight first. It's just backwards in this one. You know... Backwards, like, um, I 
was trying to think of something here, but I can't think of it. Okay, uh, I just gotta run from this fight. Can't use that drone part or anything. We'll do this just for weapon training. Episode 4, otherwise it's all downhill from here. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's episode 6. Oh, God. That's actually pretty bad. Oh, well, I mean, that's good. That they're stupid and boarding the double fire no O2 room. So are they suffocating and... Wow, what, what doges. Were they suffocating and on fire at the same time? What a way to go. What a way to go. Alright, let's get out of here. We, we want empty jumps. Look around. Okay. Uh, Federation encrypt the signal. What's going on? Yes! A small cache of 59 supplies. Okay. All right, we need a couple more small caches of 59 supplies for us to be able to catch up here. A small loan of a million dollars. You know, it's just it's just a small loan of a million dollars. Everybody in America gets one of those. I can't do I can't do a Trump. I can't do Donald Trump impression. Sorry, that was my bad attempt at Donald Trump. All right. Can I do, can I do Christopher Walken? You know, Christopher Walken is known for his, his abilities as a, as a, as a well-known actor. I can kind of do Christopher Walken. Not the best, but, okay, how, so do I even do this quest? I feel like I might alter the deal to do this one quest. I feel like to have a chance of winning this, I might have to do this quest. It's a trap. And see if this is under construction flagship. Look around. No. I would not demand the surrender of their goods. I would not do that. As a diplomatic ship ship to Alderaan. <sighs> um, I'm going to get sensors so I can use mind control aggressively, offensively. Negotiate like the Phantom Mentis. Men 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 Mentis. Phantom Mentis. <laughs> <laughs> Phantom Menace. Okay. The ships I've been hunting. Uh, um, squadron of NG ships with pirate emblems. Emblems. Okay. Obtaining new lives could save lives in the future. I'm doing it. I'm doing. It. This is the one ship we allow ourselves to kill. Besides the flagship and the other construction flagship. Besides those other two. This is the one. I'm altering the deal. Pray I don't alter it further. Further. That is that is why we're doing this. Phantom Mantis sounds scary. That does sound pretty scary. <laughs> Oh, I was going to try to stun his own people in here, huh? I actually want to dodge that if I can. And I can't. Okay. Okay. I pray you don't alter them further. You should pray for that. Thank God it didn't hit my shields or I would have been dead right there. I would have lost. I would have lost C-3PO. All right. Many Bothans died to bring us this information. Okay. All right. Those were those were the Bothan spies. We just had to help them on their death, on their death way to get us. Those were, we just had to get, recover the plans for the under construction Death Star. This deal is getting better all the time. <laughs> yeah, those are those those are basically the Death Star plans we just picked up. You know, totally totally normal, and not killing anybody for it. This gives us an extra jump to try to find under construction flagship. So we're gonna go in here. This deal's getting better all the time. Is that was that uh, Han Solo? It says that. No, that was uh, Lando Calrissian. Okay, one, two, three, four. 
five, six. I have enough to get third shield. Oh, oh, okay. Okay, it's an auto scout, so that's good for us. We're going to use only one, uh, one hacking power here. Oh, that's a good dodge. I need to dodge this one, too. Damn. Here comes a big giant missile. Oh, God. Don't hit my weapons or I'm dead. Oh, we dodged it. Luke Skywalker, best pilot in the galaxy. Damn. Okay, well, that leaves uh, low enough health that we can finish him off, though. Good dodge, man. Good dodge. Can we kill him before the next missile? Damn, can't. Okay. Wow! Luke Skywalker really is the best pilot in the galaxy. All right. Frickin' dodged two missiles, man. Frickin' Luke. If only they didn't destroy his character in The Last Jedi. Well, that's double missiles. Okay. The Force is strong with this one. <laughs> that's right. My father had it. My sister has it. Uh, I'm a little late on this. My god, he dodged another missile. He didn't dodge that one, but that was three missiles he had dodged so far. Frickin' Luke's a champion, man. Damn, didn't dodge that one. Can't dodge the two damage missiles apparently. Just the three and the just the three damage ones and the one damage ones, I guess. Plot armor is the best armor. I work with a big Star Wars fan. Literally first thing I say to him most days is use the force. <laughs> one, two, three, four. Okay. Just in case we need to go to the store earlier. I have five drone parts. I need to buy those from the store. Oh my god, why all the Asteroid fields. I mean, the good thing is, at least, you know, they're auto scouts, so we're allowed to do stuff to them. Do stuff. Please, asteroid field, please. Oh, God. Oh, God. If he hacks my shields, I'm screwed. Hacking my weapons kind of screws us, too. Yeah. Hate this game. Freaking hate this game. All right, well, we got to run from this bullshit fight. Well, weapons hack, we just can't do anything. Freaking Luke, though. Freaking Luke. Okay, we're just going to depower this and try to dodge and get out. All right, we're out. Okay. All right, let's go to the store. See if we can get something to, I don't know, increase our offense or something. Teleporter, backup battery, clone bay. Um, you know what? This is probably actually a very useful augment to keep. I need all the drone parts. Backup battery. Yes. Um, mind control to deal with borders. I was hoping for a weapon. I think we get third shield here. And then power. Yeah, we got to get defense for sure. I don't need power for that defense, but... Backup battery is useful, though. I might need to get um, level three hack... Uh, yeah, level three hacking soon. Okay, all right. If this isn't under construction flagship... Damn it. Okay. Do I dive for one more chance at the under construction flagship? <laughs> I feel like we got to risk it for the biscuit. If we do that, then we don't dive. If we, if we, I mean, if we find it, we don't dive. Actually, if it's here, we could possibly go one, two, three, four, if it's the under construction flagship. But if it's not, we have a double dive and we have a store with nothing. So I guess we go here and chance it. 
Damn. No luck for us today. We're diving. Well, hopefully with getting this kill, we can get an extra uh, engine and power, maybe. For the extra doges. Oh, that's a good dodge. Okay, uh, we need to use a hacking drone to not take a missile. Luke is actually unreal with his dodges. <laughs> Best pilot in the bat galaxy, man. I'm not such a bad pilot my myself. You could attempt to hack to give the rebels false information. Oh, this keeps him from diving. Hey, 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 that actually kept us from diving. This is cheat code actually naming your pilot Luke Skywalker. <laughs> I can't believe we actually got a vent that kept us from diving there. That's amazing. I'll buy three fuel there. The only pilot where 75% dodge isn't 0% dodge. That's right. Oh, Zoltan controlled. Oh, no. Use the false, Luke. All right, what is this quest? Oh, I think it's a delivery, a delivery quest. Promise to help. We have an NG. My NGs are great at repairing your stuff. Uh, well, I was thinking my NG was actually a C3B or something or uh, R2D2, but yeah, sure, he's fine. What could we get here? If we got another halberd, if we got like a pike beam, we could maybe get that online. Maybe they release some Easter egg in the code. We're naming your pilot Skywalker. Luke Skywalker gives you extra dodge. I don't think so. Cloaking would be great. Heavy laser. Whole laser. Small bomb. I could use this. No, I only have five bombs for that. Hmm. Long range scanners. Do I even want them? Because I don't really want ship fights. Oh, wow. That's a dead end going up that way. Okay. Cloaking would be probably the best thing we could get right now. I'm going to buy one fuel. I don't think I want any of these. To avoid ship fights? You know what? That might actually be the way to go. Long range scanners and avoid ship fights. Let's give that a try. Okay. Small research station. Damn it. Damn it. All right, so another five free drone parts. Well, I'm hoping the store, store has like a heavy laser one because that's like the one, one power weapon that would be pretty useful right now. Nope. Anything I want? No, no, fuel, I guess. Store to store buying fuel. That's what we're doing right now. Doc, try to rescue the survivors. Jones, all right. I was hoping we'd find Princess Leia there, but we found Han Solo. Han, Han Solo, the Solo NG, I guess. Sells Holton Shield. That's, that's what I need to do, yeah. All right, so if this is a ship fight, uh, I feel like I need to save scrap for stuff right now. I feel like if I don't get another weapon with my halberd beam, I'm kind of screwed. Can you tell me how to make hosts? Had six people watch me and didn't know how to. Um, a Sigonomat, if you're in your Twitch, um, whatchamacallit, creator dashboard. Are you talking about raid or hosting? Oh, God. Okay. Uh, I guess I should clarify. Are you asking how to raid somebody or just how to host? Because if you host, you just type exclamation point host and then the... Streamer's channel name. Okay, I can do eight damage here. Two, four, so that won't kill him. Just once you surrender. No surrender. Damn. Hosting, ending the stream. Host. Uh... Backslash. Did I say exclamation point? I'm sorry. It's backslash. 
I misspoke there. Oh my god. Uh I I need I need to leave. I need to not be here anymore. Okay, all right. Well, I don't want to jump to a ship fight while this is happening. That's sick of a man with the host. There it is. Thanks so much for that, my friend. Participate in their study. Sure, I would love to help research. I am a big fan of research. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Well, this is looking not so great. If this uh, mantis would die, that would be great. Okay, there we go. Okay, close these doors. Oh, Jesus. I freaking did this to my own dude. Hacked my hacking. Okay, well, I'm not going to fight this guy anyway. Just trying to get out of here. Oh, Jesus. Um, uh, please stop that. Okay, good. Okay, that's a good dodge. Frickin' Luke dodging just enough because the force is with him. The force will be with you always. Wow, he really is dodging all these missiles. Frickin' Luke, man. Clutch dodges with Luke. Oh, crap. Don't kill C-3PO. Uh, sure. Okay, all right. We're fine. We're fine. <laughs> Friggin' Luke Skywalker. Han Solo ain't got nothing on you, sir. It's a lot of intruders. How about a little more? <laughs> well, we went from a Mantis boarding event to a Zoltan boarding event. How fun is that? Both bypassing Zoltan shield, by the way. Okay. All right. Well, we got out of there. Should we get us out of here? All right, Sultan or Slug? Wow, the choices. I think Slug's actually better here. We have the mind control counter. If I get level three hacking, I can get through four shields. Next time you know how to do it, no problem, Sigurdama. I appreciate the host too. Okay, so I need this and I need level 202. Now I can backup battery the uh, thing here. C-3PO killing? Now I've seen everything. <laughs> so here I might take ship fights. No, I can't kill slugs. I don't want to take ship fights. I want them to... Sur well, slugs love to surrender, though. Take every. They always say take everything in our hold. You know what? Let's see if we can get some slugs to surrender. Slugs love surrendering because then they can cheat us out of our due. That's a glaive beam. That's a penis. You never trust slug surrenders? Well, they're usually a lower amount of stuff, but it's at least stuff. And right now, I can't really be picky. I'm just going to do this. We have to wait for a hacking every time anyway. Two shields. Can he do damage through two shields? I think he can. Slug music is pretty dope. Yeah, it is. It's very tribal. There we go. I just need to make sure I don't accidentally kill him. Accidentally on purpose. Pray we don't alter the deal any further. Okay, so I need to do... Two, four, six, eight. I can only hit three rooms. Yeah! Of course we will let you live. We love to let you live. That's what we do. <laughs> All right. Beautiful. Slug actually could be one of the best sectors for this uh, for this challenge. The fact that they often surrender. Reminds me of Skyrim music. Oh, yeah. That's a good, pretty good comparison, yeah. 
All right. We love to accept surrenders, even though we're forcefully, forcefully, forcefully forcing you to forcefully surrender. Actually, I need two of that. Oh, god damn it. Okay, thankfully I didn't... Okay, I put the backup battery in my shields. Okay, that is kind of bad for us too, but okay. Let's just go ahead and do this. Come on, surrender. No surrender. Okay, Luke. Luke, I need your dodges. Oh my god, he's so... Luke's so amazing, guys. I love Luke. Look at that. That's two of those three lasers. Freaking dodge that missile. Luke's the best. Luke is just the best. Damn, didn't dodge that one, though. Oh, he finally metamissily couldn't dodge. Freaking backup battery. They keep hitting it. Okay, uh, two, four, six, eight, nine. So I can hit four rooms. Uh, let's just hit three. That should be enough to make him surrender if he's going to. Yes! Here, we have lots of fuel. Take it all. Three fuel. Yeah, damn slugs. All right, it's fine. Trade four damage or five damage for three fuel. What a great deal. You should add a hunger bot. <laughs> to go with the... Uh, to go with the... Uh, stay hydrated bot. All right, store. What could I get with my 37 scrap? Do I have anything I could sell? I could sell titanium system casing for a heavy laser or something. I might just need to get repairs. I guess we'll check the store. This is the real Luke. It's not a fluke, just Luke. Oh, God. All right. Pre-igniter, automated reloader. Yeah, lots of stuff that would be nice. Um, do I keep the titanium system casing, actually? I probably should keep it. We are like, um, kind of floating, floating at the edge of living here. Don't have enough power. It's kind of amazing we've made it this far. If we even make it to Sector 8, I would say that's pretty GG. We got eight civilian ships, man. We got to do it. Oh my God. That is a scary pirate. I rate pirate right there. Okay. Man, I can't hit his shields and his weapons here. Which really sucks. Um do I take out do I try to take out a weapon or do I try to just do as much damage to get him to surrender? Cause I can do eight damage or I can do six and hit his weapons. I think it's better if I do this. Damn. And make it so it can't repair it. It's a good dodge. Kill your friends. Kill your friends. No, Luke Mr. Doge. Mr. Doge, he Mr. Doge. Come on, come on, Luke. I need it. I need your Doge. No. Uh, he's beginning to doubt himself. All right, we got to get out. I should have left earlier. Uh... Most gracious captain, you must join me in a drink to our alliance. 
<laughs> um, would, would a diplomatic ship to Alderaan accept a drink, drink from a slimy slug man? Lucas succumbing to the dark side. <laughs> It is what what would a what a diplomatic mission to Alderaan do this? Yes, drink. Great. Oh. Okay. Okay, that's Okay. That's great. I have another weapon. Beautiful. I thought that was always a bad thing. I didn't know that there was actually a good thing that could happen there. See? Nice guys finish first. <laughs> it's a drink to peace. I just love peace. Especially when it's a bunch of pieces of my enemies. Getting wrecked, right? Diplomacy for the win. For to wins. For to lulls. Alright, attack the ship. 50-50 chance to get 10 HP repair in store versus lose 25 to 35 scrap. I guess it's been so rare that I've gotten the 10 repair and store that I just always refuse and take the fight. I don't know why I don't trust in, uh, slugs more. Don't know why. Okay, if I could get... Oh, what is, what is he going to hack? I need to get his weapons offline, I think. Okay, we got the halberd beam offline. Backup battery hack, fine. Perfectly fine with that. And if we do this, we never lose our shields from this ion. Auto scout, you've auto scouted for the last auto scouting time. I can do this because he won't be able to dodge. And I can just get his shields offline for a halberd shot. What? Why did my... God damn it. Does this charge in time? Damn it. Friggin' backup battery hack is, is not very strong, but it's just annoying. Just wish I could choose where the power goes out of because going out of my weapons is the worst. I'm just going to... Take power out of here. And make sure my weapon stays online. There. You die, Auto Scout. Nothing useful. 59 scrap, though. It's just it's just better usually to refuse because a fight means more scrap. Yeah, and that's what I'm used to doing, for sure. Okay. All right. Distress call on a slug sector. Don't know if I should trust that. Do I have enough to kill the boss with this build? I don't know, man. What's a peaceful diplomatic run? We're only allowed to kill auto scouts, and we basically take all the deals. Five moons. Five. Five moons. Welcome aboard. Fired him. All right. So we found Obi Wan Rand. No, Obi Rand Kenobi, guys. Obi Rand. Kenobi. He is he is the master of mind manipulation. He was teaching Rand all about the Force. The Force is strong with this one. He's helping Rand understand. Rand Obi Rand Kenobi helps Luke understand that he's not dodging. He's he knows where the shots are coming from. That's no moon. <laughs> There's a Jedi. He can't be mind control. That's right. That's right. Uh, would I believe a slug man that we have problem coming from our oxygen generation unit? <laughs> Do we have a blue option with a slug here? I feel like there's supposed to be a blue option here. Actually, I think it's Mantis watches over the repairs. I think there's going to be free damage. All right, we'll send some crew to help. Oh, they killed Obi-Wan Kenobi. They killed Obi Rand, guys. Damn it. I just. <laughs> no! That was that was Darth Vader. Just killed just killed Obi Rand. Now now Luke's gotta avenge him. <laughs> just, just immediately killed him. Just immediate. Uh Oh, my backup battery's already going. Okay. Uh, 
Oh, my backup battery. Damn you, game. Ah, freaking help, man. Luke, your your dodges are slipping, man. Yeah, he's dodging nothing now. This 35% dodge is down to nothing. Big crap tastic ball of nothing. Yeah, he's dodged like none of the last like five shots. Come on, come on, Luke. Keep wanting to call him Rand. Come on, Luke. Surrender. Damn it, they're not going to surrender. I don't think, anyway. Do I take one more shot? Do I think that will surrender if I do a small enough damage? Eh, we just got to run. Darth Vader with his prosthetic legs had the high ground. <laughs> He's in grief. What do you expect? A refugee ship. Let's help them. Oh, darn. It's a bunch of slugs who want to kill us. I'm so surprised by this right now. This is my surprised face. Nope, we have a fire. Uh, let's go here. Okay. Hey, there's a doge. Damn. Stop mind controlling my dudes. Come on, surrender, slug people. Slug people, slug people. I guess, uh, you know what? I should, I should have swapped. Wait, who's my weapons guy? R2-D2, why aren't you on weapons? Because you moved me, sir. Just an excuse. I mean, beep, boop, 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 boop. Okay, so I need to not kill him. No surrender. No surrender. Damn it! Now we got uh, we got R2D2 trained in weapons one point. Okay. Uh, do we attack the rebels? I think we leave them be because that's what a deep peaceful diplomatic mission to Alderaan would do. Leave them be. <clears throat> that's it's pretty sad that. Uh, the second we got Obi-Wan Kenobi, the next jump, he just died. <laughs> uh, fitting, but sad. I feel like he didn't really get to show us his true potential. All right. I need lots of repair stations, if nothing else, because I need drone parts. I feel like I just need to start buying power here. Um, I don't know what our plan is to actually kill kill the flagship with this build. Is it a rough run? Well, when you uh, uh oh crap reboarders. When you're skipping half the fights yeah, you don't get a lot of scrap. Oh, there's an ASB here too. Unlimited power. <laughs> hey, what's up, we Titans? What's the challenge you're doing? No more three for three? No, not three for three. We're doing a goofy Star Wars themed um, challenge run. It's kind of crazy what we're doing, actually. Okay, go in there and let's vent them. 
A Star Wars themed um, pacifist dip diplomatic mission to Alderaan run is what we're doing. Best challenge ever. <laughs> you don't understand how this is working? I don't know that working... Working might be optimistic. We're alive and we're in Sector 8. For us, skipping so many ship fights, it's pretty good. I mean, we're also on normal difficulty. It's been fun. It's certainly been a fun run. Um, I, getting the win, that's... That's probably pretty optimistic. Actually, winning this run is probably optimistic. I was hoping for a couple repair stations. Um, excuse me. Do I want to dodge? I need to at least be able to have my shields up with my backup battery online, so I just keep getting power, I guess. Going to be looking for us to stream. Have fun. Take care, everyone. Thanks again, Johnny, for your uh, donation. You are a bro, man. You are looking, sir. All right. At least I can kill this auto scout. That's our condition. We can kill auto scouts. And we can... Um, but otherwise, we have to take peaceful deals or run away and stuff. Oh, crap. Come on, Luke. I need you to doge, sir. Oh, I almost one-shot C-3PO. Come on, man. Come on, help me out here, game. Help. Oh, jeez, this is bad. And there goes my, there goes my heavy laser. Oh, okay. He dodged that one. When we had less dodge, he dodged it. In the clutch moments, Luke dodges. Okay, that's a good dodge. Yeah. Mini beam hit there. Okay, we need to get our engines back to, to fold out. Can I get out? Nope. Oh my god. You're almost dead, sir. Can I kill him? Can I can I can I can I can I can I, can I, can I kill him? Please don't please don't cloak. Okay, all right. Ten health on that fight, but uh, hey, we we get we killed him. <laughs> Ow! Ow! No, not Binks. He must live. Jar Jar Binks must live to the end, so he can reveal his true identity as a Sith Lord. Find your lack of faith disturbing. Okay. <laughs> Why aren't the NGs C-3P and R2? Because C-3P and R2 started on the ship, and this ship started with a bunch of Zolt hands, so that's why. Because you're coming in late, that's why. Uh, okay, 82 scrap. I need, like, a free repair or something. Uh, what What is the best thing? I guess it's just having our shields online. We back up battery level three in our mind control. Can I get one more dodge? Okay. Four dodge, three shields. <laughs> Never found Leia. Never. She's probably on the Death Star. You know, that's what I'm thinking. Now, I wonder if this guy will surrender. I'm guessing probably not. Rand, did you hear about Crying Sun? Steam page says it's FTL meets Dune. It's not out yet, but you can play demo. You're going to try it later tonight. Thought you would be interested. Matt Colombo, um, tell me, after you try it out, tell me something about it. Because I feel like I've looked at it, but I don't remember. So I'd be interested to see your, hear your thoughts after you give it a try. It sounds familiar, though. Would you like to surrender, please? Would you please care to surrender? Ow. Only one, uh, two damage there, actually. Sure, if you catch next stream. Well, it won't be till next Monday, but it's fine. I don't have time to... I won't be able to try out other games myself for a little while anyway. Uh, ah, crap. We're not going to be able to stop them killing that. 
Okay, would you like to surrender yet? No. One, two, three, four, five, six. So I can hit two rooms. Yes! Yes! You are considerably more well armed than I would have thought. We surrender! It's right, you surrender. It's right, you surrender. Han Solo running at him with a gun. Ah! You have much better guns than we thought you would have. Alright, going in the boss fight. Missing 13 health. It's fine. Do I do one more fight? No. <laughs> what do I even get here? It's a dark day when your anti-boarding is two NGs. I know, right? Do I get one more power? No, I can back up battery that. I probably get the mind control value point. I mean, <laughs> there's, there's nothing I can... We made it to the boss. That's probably going to be our GG cookie time here. Saber engine, huh? I don't know. Okay, what are you gonna hack, sir? Well, you, we won't know until you get through my Sultan shield. Do do ba do. Is there any way I can mind control this guy? Yeah. Okay. Let's see if we can get his missiles offline. That might be our our way in here. Please don't hack my weapons. If he hacks my weapons. Oh, that's the that's probably the best hack we could have gotten right there. Alright, well, we did get the missiles offline for a bit at least. But now we just gotta wait for uh freaking hacking every time and time it correctly with the cloaking. Okay, all right, if we do it now, I think we can get the shot through. Hit the what, uh, piling first, hopefully he doesn't dodge. Okay, all right, missile still down. Fight each other. Luke with the clutch dodges, man. That was a zero damage phase one with three shields and four dodge and not being able to power them. Wow. <laughs> That's kind of amazing. That's actually kind of amazing right there. Zero damage phase one. Clutch Luke dodges and keeping their missiles down. The force, the force is strong with this one. <laughs> All right, do I go for an extra fight for extra scrap? I. I don't think it's worth it. I don't think it's worth taking extra damage for more scrap. What do you guys think? I mean, I'm not I'm not guaranteed allowed to kill somebody. It'd have to be an auto scout for us to be able to do it. So pacifist would just wait. We're a pacifist. Okay. All right. There's phase one down. Here's where things go all to hell. I do not have anti-boarding for the boarding drone. So wherever he goes... I'm kind of screwed. Phase three, no matter what, will smoke me most likely. Yeah, most likely. I, I have a I have a feeling that phase two is gonna smoke me, honestly. Whew, that's pretty good. I did that while that was off screen right there. I don't want to toot my own horn or anything, but uh, yeah. Uh, let's see. How do I do this? Do I do the same thing where I try to get the missiles offline? Drone control scarier, but. Maybe, nah, I'll probably do the same thing. I don't think we have a chance anyway, but we'll just do this. As soon as that boarding drone gets in here, we're pretty much screwed. Where'd he go? Okay, he's in my hacking. That's actually probably pretty good. 
All right, we hit a shield. So, okay, I guess we just let him kill our hacking. Hopefully we get a second hack off. So hacked off right now. Here comes the drone phase. Here's where shit hits the fan. All right, we're going to wait for our hack here. We need the clutch loop dodges. Okay, I do get a partial hack here, I think. Yes, okay, we got enough to get it down to one. Okay. My control so they can't repair that. Wow, the Luke, the Luke, the force is strong with this one. Uh, without hacking, this is going to be hard to finish, though. Like, really hard to finish. Can I hit? I can hit four rooms. I should probably stop hitting the missiles then. Four damage. Two four damage. A three plus a four will kill him. Let's do this, then. If I do this and then hit a four one. The problem's going to be this right here. Oh, good. He still only has one shield. Okay. Okay, these dodges have still been pretty pretty clutch. Okay. <laughs> All right, two phases down. All right. Not bad. Not bad with this setup. We've actually got phase one and phase two down. Can't dodge beams. True. We have uh, eight health left, and that's only because the clutch Luke dodges, man. I cannot believe those uh, drone phases didn't do more damage to us. I actually can't believe that. But here's where it all breaks down. <laughs> Who said the Death Star would be easy? <laughs> All right, well, we follow him and get boarded, I guess, and run away. Um, 44 scrap. Do we get a power? Do we get value point heal bay? Those are basically their two options here. Heal, heal bay value point or power. Yeah, I know. Getting through Zoltan's shield with these weapons plus boarding and power surge, yeah. Diplomatic kidnapping. That's right. We're just we're just bringing Lo we're just bringing Leia home, guys. Uh, I think if I could get max doors, that's what I would do. What are my chances? One out of five? More like one out of a million. Never tell me the odds. I'm gonna get power so I can keep my heal bay online. I think. Their second peaceful ending SMPK instruction might be easier. <laughs> Actually, I don't think it's easier. Uh, and I do know that ending you're talking about. I think that's in... Is that in SMPK or is it in... Captain Edition? I can't remember. Maybe it's in both. More dodge. I was thinking about more dodge. Maybe that was the way to go. I don't think there's a way we do this. That was two dodges, though. It's pretty good. Here comes the yikes. All right, let's see what happens. Rough stuff right there. All right, I need my piloting to stay online if I'm going to have a chance to run away. <laughs> run away and fight another day. Okay, can you go ahead and board? I need them to be here, and then we jump. All right, you know what? It's fine. It's fine. R2-D2 is about to die. Don't die. Okay. All right. Um, everybody get out of there in mind control so they fight each other. There we go. Need my O2 back up. I need this back up. Luke must dodge the force. Uh, the force? Uh, dodge... Dying, I guess. Surprised I got this far. Me too. 
We'll call this a win. <laughs> I'm gonna GG cookie time this, even though we're about to die. Uh, we got to phase three of the boss and actually survived the first half of his boarding, so. Boarders teleporting on board. Hello there. <laughs> All right. Three health. We got this, guys. Phase three, no problem. This is how this is how a new hope should have ended right here. Um Okay, all right, let's go. Got this. Unless Duke uh, Duke, unless Luke has the best dodges I've ever seen in this video game. He's about to be GG here. No, he still has more borders. Actually, he's sending his pilot. Well, maybe that will ruin his dodges. I feel like I've not seen him just send his pilot before. I just don't play in normal mode where these are, aren't connected very often, though. Yeah. Here it comes. All right, humans coming on board. Here's and here's the death knell. Bam, GG, no! The Rebel Alliance has been crushed. I'm gonna say GG cookie time because we got to phase three of the boss with uh, <laughs> a 2686 score, by the way. Rip, Rebels win, just like they're supposed to. 959 scrap. <laughs> There's there's a golf score for you right there. <laughs> Eleven ships defeated. Eleven ships defeated. So that was all auto scouts. We didn't get the under construction flagship. So that would have been ten auto scouts and the one NG quest. <laughs> That's pretty hilarious right there, actually. All right, that was a fun run. That was fun. That was ridiculous, but that was pretty fun. You think I could do it on easy? Uh, I'd have to have the RNG I had right there, because um, we actually got a lot of free scrap there. Total amount of dodges. Do they have that? Most pilot evasions. Uh, I didn't get the record. 416 is my most. Uh, too bad. I, I wish it would show my session dodges for Luke. Real quick, guys, I'm going to stretch. We'll do one more fun run. Let me know if you guys think we should do one more on this or should we should do some hard mode, just random ship or something. So thank you all so much for watching. Is anybody in the stream, please hit the follow. Hope you guys are enjoying the stream. I'm having a blast. I'll be back right back. We'll do one last run for the day.